Now joining us live via uh, Skype is the Head Research Lagos Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Matthew Ojo. Good morning, Mr. Ojo. Good morning. Now talks, morning. thank you for coming on. Uh, there, is, there are talks on fear of looming increased inflation. In your opinion, are we already in inflation? Of course, we, we, if you look at the trend since uh, the beginning of the year, you will see that uh, inflation has been increasing. Uh, already, in the comparison from the news you read, you see that uh, even though the increase is marginal, but we know that in the next coming months, increase, uh, inflation will trend higher. And the reason is not far-fetched. You can see that uh, even though the reason given by... Uh, the NBS for the increase, marginal increase, uh, they, they did mention uh, closed borders as well as uh, implementation of the uh, of the new VAT regime. That's 7.5 percent. However, we know that with the naira losing its value currently, uh, that will affect uh, inflation. And then uh, you also see that uh, productive activities is at its lower lowest ebb. And if you don't have uh, production going on, supply is not there. And when you do have supply and people have money to, or they want to buy something, uh, you, you find out that what, if everybody wants to buy the same thing and it's cash, the price will go high. And so it's, it's understandable that uh, 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 inflation is increasing, but obviously everyone knows that this will still go higher than what we are seeing now. now so what are the options available in the face of COVID-19? Well, in the face of COVID-19, is to ensure that, in as much as the uh, the government is trying to ensure that we keep uh, uh, the, the social distance rule and all that, our production does not uh, uh, die out completely. Because if farmers don't go and produce, uh, this these are like the planting season, and then if a restriction is uh, is uh, you know applied to essential services, food and all that. People can get what they need to get, and the little they get, they have to pay higher for it. Now, government also needs to find a way of uh, uh, stimulating. You know, the, the way it is now, government is 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 uh, it, it, it's not a good time to be in government, if I may say, because you have to ensure you sustain the economy. You also have to ensure that there's continuity in business. So, anything that will ensure that this too keeps on running, that there's continuity in business, production, and people are not. Uh, uh, losing their jobs and all that will help in reducing inflation because when you have prices trending higher and you are able to give people the means to reach those things they want to buy, that, that's, that will help serve as a palliative in a way. Mm -hmm. So uh, there, there, are, there are so many things government can do at, at this time mm -hmm. to ensure that there is this liquidity in the hands of, of the citizens and also not just citizens, also businesses as well. Yeah, sustaining, sustaining uh, the economy is a crucial one, you know, at this time. So what would be your, you know, practical recommendation uh, for the period that we found ourselves in? Uh, we, we, like you did mention, uh, the Lagos Chamber uh, has made some recommendations. First, you want to ensure that uh, business continue running. You want to ensure that uh, business owners don't lay off people. Because when you, uh, we are already in a bad state in terms of unemployment in Nigeria. And if uh, that is not curtailed, it, it turns this other, it will trend higher. So what would government do? Government will need to look at measures of ensuring that businesses, uh, they, 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 they are able to uh, continue in their operations and not lay off. So you want to consider what you can do in the physical uh, policy side as well as in the monetary uh, policy side. For the physical Fiscal side, you can, the government needs to look at how do they tinker with the tax uh, regime to ensure that uh, the, 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 the palliatives are given to businesses.